Meeting's not done, but I want hands ready. I want everybody to get a little tickle here. Are we ready? One, two, three, two. We're awake. That's what I want to hear. Okay. Uh, to finish this off, guys, I got a short message for you. Okay. Some of you all are probably looking up here, wondering what these buckets are. Okay. Um, some of you guys asked early on this morning that you know that, that kind of question. I, I mentioned this to Nick. Uh, who else did I mention to Mason? When I was coaching, we used to put buckets uh, in our morning workouts kind of across the gym, trash cans, and our girls would come in and they'd just be like, oh shit, well, what are we about to do? Like, kind of just get in their brain a little bit, kind of see, we just already just tip their bottle over, you know, and then we would do something completely different, you know. But anyway, uh, it got you thinking a little bit. Uh, these buckets have water in them, all right? There's different increments of water up here in every single bucket, all right? I uh, can't really find clear ones, it doesn't really matter. Um, Cody, uh, Donovan and Andrew, please come up here. Uh, I don't really care what bucket you stand in front of, it doesn't matter, but I want you to stand in front of a bucket. Alright? I think the same as the So big boy though, right? Guys, what 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 I want you to think about is have you ever heard the uh, the phrase carrier water? In in, in, in any phrase. In, in any type of context, carrier water. Okay, um, it can mean a lot of different things. It can literally be like if you have a, I, I have a son who every practice we go to, I'm carry your fucking water. I'm tired of carrying, so I say it a lot. Carry your water. Okay, it can be something as simple as um, you know just carrying your responsibilities for the day. And obviously, water can be a lot of different things. Okay, um, so. I gave you kind of an answer there. All right, anybody have anything else that they thought of when I said carry your water? Weight. Carry your weight. Carry your weight. Absolutely. Okay? I agree wholeheartedly with that, Nick. Um, so like I said, each bucket up here has different levels of water, and there's no method to why they have different levels in there. But I want you to understand, every single day when you wake up, okay, understand you're going to have a burden that you're going to carry throughout the day. Or you're going to have successes that you're going to carry throughout the day. All right? My hope is that you all have successes that outnumber the burdens. All right? But life happens. So I, I understand that, yes, there are days you, have, you just have to carry the burdens. Sometimes that's just going to be a small burden. All right? Hopefully those successes outweigh that. All right? So basically how I envision this, guy, this exercise, the water just truly exemplifies winning. It exemplifies success. It exemplifies the habits all right, that, that you have. It exemplifies high level of integrity. It, ex it exemplifies exceptional attitude, winning habits. You know, I, I've talked about that numerous times with everybody here, right? Okay? So every single day, Andrew, Cody, Donovan, all right, their water level is going to be different every single day, more than likely. Okay? Every single job they go to. Is their water level going to be a little different? Is it going to be high? Is it going to be low? They might have to provide a different type of water level mentality when they arrive on a job. Okay? Um, just in, with the bucket that you're standing in front of, just kind of pick it up and kind of hold it. Don't do anything other than just kind of pick it up. If you want to hold it in front of you, that's fine. All right? You can put it, you can put it back down. All right? Obviously, holding that bucket of water, was that really hard right there? No. No. Okay, if you had to carry that bucket the entire day, would that be a little strenuous on you? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Absolutely, because you're using two hands, all right? You guys all picked it up with two hands? Yes. Okay, you didn't free up another hand. I was seeing if one of you guys would do that, okay? Sometimes you need a little bit of help, so you have to use two hands. The cool thing about this, guys, Donovan, right now, you have the, the highest water level. Mm -hmm. Okay, Andrews is close down there. All right, the cool thing about this, guys, is at any moment, Donovan has an opportunity to pour his water into another bucket, okay? Cody, if Cody's running ox on a specific day, do you think his water level is going to be a little bit higher, a requirement, than maybe Donovan's, if he's just out running a job, maybe? Potentially. He's got a lot of shit going on, right? Cody, would you agree with that? I would agree. Does that mean his job's more important? No. No, absolutely not. That's not what I'm saying. But understand, guys, all right? He's got to be able to carry his water at a high level, even though it's heavy, okay? The cool thing about this, Donovan, I want you to pick that bucket up, all right? Cody, which bucket did you pick up? The lightest one? Okay. <laughs> Donovan, <laughs> why don't you pour some water in that bucket? Pour it all. 
That's good. Okay. You put it back down. All right. Immediately, Donovan's just pouring some water into, into Cody's bucket. He's pouring some winning habits. He's pouring some energy. We just have the positive energy transfer right there. I haven't even talked about that, guys. All right. Donovan is, is just infusing Cody with some knowledge, some wisdom that he has, right? He just gave it to him a little bit like, man, I'm giving you a little extra. All right. It's going to be heavy, but I got you. All right. You know the cool thing about that, though? Cody, take that water bucket, pour it back in Donovan. All right? Cool. Pour some in Andrews. Right? <laughs> now, now pick your bucket up, Cody. Is it a little bit lighter? It's a little bit lighter. It is a little bit lighter. Okay? It is a little bit lighter because you just poured into your teammates. You just poured into Andrew, to Donovan. You just poured your knowledge, your wisdom, your winning habits, your exceptional behavior, your high level of integrity into other guys. Okay? And the cool thing about that, guys, is that that water can transfer all over the place. It's really, really cool. And now, now Cody's able to carry that bucket probably all fucking day because he just expanded his knowledge, expanded his water. Okay? Now, Donovan, this is a little heavy. Okay? He's got a wingman. He's got a teammate. He can pour it to somebody else's. All right? Uh, Andrew, what I want you to do, I want you, yeah. what I want you to do, I want you to stick your hand in that water, all right, and pull it out. I want you to tell me what you see, what happens. Go for it. Well, you gotta look at the water, man. Um, and then pull it out. What what happens to the water when you put your hand in there? It's rounded. Or it moves. It moves. What else? What else do you guys think when you pour his hand in? What happens? It rises. Right? And then you pull and then you pulled your hand out, what did the water do? It went back down. Okay? Two things I think about when I see that example. First thing is none of us is indispensable. Okay? Meaning, we don't have to fucking be here. We don't need Everybody, okay. When Andrew poured his, pour, uh, excuse me, pulled his hand out of that water, did the water disappear? No, it just went back to the regular level. Okay. Nobody's indispensable, you know, including me. Okay. Understand that. So when you pour yourself into something, all right, and you pull it out, all right, life, life, life goes on. Okay. The other thing I think about is when Andrew puts his hand into it, the, it, it, the level just raises up. Right? That was obvious. All right? To me, that just exemplifies that when you pour into something, that is absolutely just going to raise the level of what you're pouring into. If you never put, if you just put your fingertip in there, it's not going to do shit. If you're going to put your fist in there, it's not going to do as much. But when you put your whole hand into something, that water level is going to rise. Okay? Just as if Don, when Donovan poured water into Cody, Cody poured water into Andrews, the water level rose. All right? Carry your water at a high level. Okay? Does that analogy make sense? Okay? Yes, the transfer of the water is super important. Okay? I, I'm throwing some weird shit at you guys, right? Making your bed. Alright? Changing the world. The transfer of positive feelings and positive energy. We did that exercise with Adrian. Alright? That shit matters. Okay? We talked about sand and water. Your water bottle getting tipped over. Alright? Raise your hand if you feel like your water bottle has been tipped over multiple times since you've been here. Yeah, all right, your character's revealed every single moment, okay? But a bucket's gonna be there to, to capture it all for you. Understand that, because that's, we're all part of the team, all right? Are you willing to carry your water today, Donovan? Yes, sir. Are you willing to carry your water today? Yes, sir. Are you willing to carry your water today? Yes, sir. Are all of you willing to carry your water today? Yes, sir. Yeah. Are all of you willing to pour into your teammate's water bucket if need be, or accept their water into your bucket. I sure fucking hope so, because that's why we won in February, that's why we won in January, that's why we're going to win in March, and it's going to keep going. All right? You better get your hands ready, because it's coming. One, two, three, KC! Oh, shit. Let's go.